gift wrapping season na naman and if gusto nyong magpa-impress sa inyong mga exchange gift then watch this video para turuan namin kayo kung paano i-level up ang inyong Christmas gift wrapping skills plus bonus eco-friendly pa siya. For those who are new here, Common Room is a shared retail and digital space for over 200 Filipino makers and artists. If you're looking for unique locally made products, we have branches in Power Plant Mall, UP Town Center, Alabang Town Center, and Ayala Malls, Manila Bay. Ang star of the episode natin today ay ang ating mga old paper bags. Bakit? Dahil ang dami-dami nating old paper bags sa bahay. Hindi natin matapon kasi masyado silang maganda pero hindi din natin magamit kasi laging may bagong paper bag. So today, we're going to show you how to use these old paper bags in different ways para maging gift wrapper siya. You'll also need the following materials. Twine, craft tape, tuyong dahon, at kung meron, seed paper tags. Lahat yan by degradable para friendly tayo sa environment. Wala namang exact science yung pag-gift wrap natin ito. Makikita nyo nga parang sobrang basic lang nung ginawa ko, ba? And ang reason for that is for me kasi kahit super basic siya, ginupit lang natin, tiniklop natin, nilagyan natin ng tape. Naniniwala kasi ako sa end product niya na cute na siya, na hindi mo na kailangan pagpabonggahin yung pagtiklop. Kumbaga, craft tape lang siya na neutral, lagyan mo lang siya na neutral string. Dagdagan mo, kapalan mo yung paglagay ng string para magamit pa nila after. <laughs> lagyan mo ng paper tag and then lagyan mo lang ng leaf or yung mga mamayang tutorial. Papakita ko other ways to use it or decorate it. Pero alam ko na okay na siya. Simple lang siya. Okay na siya after kahit wala siya masyadong frills. So in our next tutorials, makikita natin, ganito pa rin yung base natin. Pero we'll give you tips on how to decorate it in a number of ways para hindi lang naman siya ganito lang. Another way to decorate our craft gift wrappers ay to use your old postcards at home. Kung meron kayong magagandang art prints, postcards na nakuha sa mga art fairs, conventions, and you feel like sayang naman kung nakatambak lang siya sa house, di ba? Might as well use it for someone who you think mag-resonate doon sa art print na yun. And for this tutorial, siya ang star of the show. So aside from old postcards, gagamit rin tayo ng same materials na ginamit natin kanina. Old paper bag, twine, and craft tape. What makes this gift wrapping method special for me is mas malaki yung susulatan mo ng message. So kapag matanggap nila yon, more than just having a cute gift from you, di ba? Mas merong kang space to express your thoughts through the postcard. <music> For this activity naman, same pa rin all the process. But, instead na ibalot na natin and i-decorate after, mauuna muna yung decoration. So, ang gagawin natin is magsa-stamp muna tayo para parang gumawa na tayo ng sarili nating art print on our old paper bag. Guys, aminin nyo, pag nakatanggap kayo nito, isipin nyo ba na old paper bag siya? <laughs> Hindi, di ba? And you can be as playful as you want kasi ako gusto ko lang medyo minimalist. So that's why ito yung stamp na ginamit ko. But you can be creative. You can use a flower. You can use a text. You can be as fun as you want. Maybe a bunny. It all depends on your aesthetic and theme for your gift wrappers this season. Okay, so for this activity, medyo makalat siya <laughs> dahil tayo ay magpipaint. So if you're feeling a bit adventurous, then this is the tutorial for you. Nakaready na ako. You have to use your apron. 
And sana may cover yung table nyo para hindi mapinturahan. And now, we'll paint. And again, tulad nung gift wrapper natin kanina using stamps, you can also be as adventurous as you want. It doesn't have to be black or white. Kung anong color na gusto mo or favorite color ng pagbibigyan mo, pwede mong pagdaruan. It doesn't have to be splatters also. You can actually paint if you want. Paint flowers, paint polka dots, stripes, etc. Those are the things that you can do also using paint and old recycled bags. Okay, for the next craft tutorials naman, ito naman ay hindi na tayo gagamit ng old paper bag. Uh, gagamit na tayo ng mga artist creations. So, for this one naman, gift wrapper pa lang <laughs> regalo na. Kasi alam mong magaganda. This one is an old one by an old roomy si Swat by Mayang. Sobrang ganda talaga ng mga gift wrappers niya. And alam mong one-off siya. Like, hindi lahat ng tao makakatanggap na ganitong gift wrapper. So, sobrang special niya. Mayami tayong mga artist na gumagawa ng gift wrappers for Christmas. Sometimes, si Ella Lama gumagawa siya, si Cheryl Owen, si Shop Yule. So, marami namang options if you know where to look. Marami din tayong mga eco-friendly alternatives other than dahon and jute wine. <laughs> we also have mga dried flowers. Those are options. So, parang bagay siya kasi medyo nature yung theme niya, diba? So, naglagay tayo ng pop of color using a dried flower. I'm aiming for rustic for this gift wrapper. Gumamit tayo ng raffia, then jute wine. So, ito yon. Natural din siya. And also, ang jute wine may iba't ibang kapal din siya. So, kanina, we've been using a thin one. Meron ding makapal. Those are options for your gift wrapper. So, hindi naman kayo mauubusan. <laughs> Kung talaga namang nag-rush ka na and <laughs> ayaw mo nang mag-gift wrap, isa pang option is of course using a tote bag. Ilalagay na lang natin siya. Ganun lang siya kadali. Ilalagay lang natin yung gift natin. Ganyan. Ganyan na ganyan lang. Pwedeng i-ribbon natin. Lagyan ng tag and special message. And ready to go na ang iyong gift. Ito ay isang magandang option kapag nagregalo ka. And syempre, medyo may kamahalan din naman ng tote bag. Gift na rin siya. So, might as well make it a part of the gift, di ba? So, kung magbibigay ng tote bag, not just any tote bag. Of course, dapat alam mo yung personality ng pagbibigyan mo. your special someone. And naayon ang design ng tote bag para sa pagbibigyan mo. Anong pinaka nagustuhan nyo sa ating gift wrappers today? Hopefully, you can comment below so I know kung ano yung pinaka nagustuhan nyo sa lahat ng ginawa natin today. And hopefully, may natutunan kayo and sana makatulong para hindi kayo masyadong nag-rush or nas-stress this Christmas season. And if you like this episode, please like and subscribe also. And... Most of the materials that you see here can be found in Common Room. We have an online shop, www.commonroompage.com. You can also find us in Power Plant Mall, UP Town Center, Alabang Town Center, and Ayala Malls, Manila Bay. Thank you everyone, Merry Christmas, and enjoy wrapping!